I'm in my garage and I got to get rid of a lot of junk. Clear this place out. So I'm going to try the dumpster bag. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I have got to clear out my garage. I want to do some updating here and I've just got lots of junk, so I need to go through it. And one of the things that I've got to do is take down these cabinets. I've got a shelf over here that I've got to take down, these pegboards, all of that stuff, and I've got to get rid of them. And I was thinking about getting a dumpster, but when I looked at even the pretty small dumpsters, the 10 and 20 yard dumpsters, they were like 600 and some dollars for the dumpster. And I thought, you know, I don't really have that much stuff. You know, once I cut this up, it's gonna be pretty small. It's just kind of big right now because it's built out, but it's not a lot of actual refuse. So the alternative that I looked at was the Bagster. So let's check it out. All right, so here is the Bagster. It's by Waste Management. They are actually my waste company. And so what you can do here is just order these things. And this is what it looks like. It's kind of this big nylon bag, I guess. And you just fill this sucker up and then you schedule. It looked like you could do it on the website, request someone to come, and then they bring this truck with this crane and just pick it up. I think this thing will hold up to 3,000 pounds, 3,300 pounds, and it's three cubic yards, 606 gallon capacity. So think about like those 55 gallon oil drums, you know, you could fit 10 of those bad boys in here. So I thought this might be a cheaper solution because the pickup for this thing was like 200 some dollars, I think 225, $230, something like that. And the bagster itself was about $25. Now I actually bought two of these because I thought if I do fill this up, I can open up a second one and then it's only like $150 to have a second one picked up. So you don't have to pay the full 200 since they're already coming, you get a little bit of discount on the second one. So that's why I ordered two of these. Now. I'm kind of curious about how good this works. One, if it's going to be able to hold all my stuff. And then two, I want to see what the experience is like of ordering the pickup and then having them come and pick it up. Now, I'm actually going to put this in my driveway and I think that they might pull in my driveway. That's a pretty big truck to pull in my driveway, but it does look like it has a big boom arm. All right, so let's get this thing set up, some waste in it and see what it does. All right, I pulled the bag out here and it actually gives some instructions here. Where can I place my bag? And basically they're saying this is going to be a big truck that comes here on your yard on your driveway but if you are going to put it on your driveway you have to sign a waiver and it says it's attached to the bag somewhere so if they have to drive in your driveway just be aware that you can't have paver stones and might do some damage big trucks but i think it's gonna be okay you can see here the material i mean it seems like really heavy woven nylon you can see the big straps they kind of look like cargo straps but they are also nylon too so it's really a one use thing i mean this thing is going to be trash itself as well so i'm just going to continue to open this up so i've got it opened here it kind of stands about two and a half feet tall it looks like and maybe seven feet long well surprise it works because it's not a rigid bottom or anything but let's get it filled and see if they can haul the garbage away all right, now to schedule collection, you actually don't have to have the bag filled yet. I did in my case, but if you know when the bag is going to be filled, you can just schedule it for a future date. And what you have to do here is you have to select the date that you want the bag picked up. Now, I will say for $120, they will guarantee pickup on that particular day. However, they may pick it up after that day based on whatever the schedule is like for your area. So I didn't pay that extra fee. I just picked the day that I knew it was going to be ready. And they actually did come on that particular day. So that was really nice. So you do everything online on the portal, you schedule it, you make the payment. And then on that day, they arrive and pick it up. Now, I will say that they pick mine up first thing in the morning so it was like 7 30 a.m they were there i think i was probably the first stop if you are not there and the bag is available they will just pick it up but in my case the bag was blocked in by my car i didn't know when they were going to show up i didn't even know they were going to show up on that day so the dispatcher called me and said hey we're there but we're blocked in by your car so i moved my car they just pulled in grabbed the bag it took about five minutes in total to hook up and get rid of the bag and leave so it's very very quick it was really convenient if the bag is somewhere where they can just pick it up then you don't have to do anything about it it's kind of like a regular car to pick up but at about 225 dollars and getting a bunch of stuff out of my garage i was really happy with it it was much easier and less impactful and visually impactful than getting a full-on dumpster so if you want to use a bagster bag for your next cleanup i'll put a link to it in the description below peter von panda out we can discover more and explore so much deeper. We can live better than.